What's up? Um, uh, cover. I'm gonna do today. Uh, this time, uh, <clears throat> it's a uh, some I've obviously never done on recording, but I have played him off recording. Only two solo play of his, which are called "Talk to One Another" and "Created Me a Clean Heart." Now, I heard the song "Created Me a Clean Heart." Originally at church, I, I've heard it before you guys stopped doing that video, you know, the Baptism Sunday promotions or whatever, promotional. There's a black light video with pictures of people who've been baptized, and then they had like a, sort of a like a, creating me a clean heart, oh God, and renew a right spirit within me. You know, that's Keith's version, but I don't know who even said some of those things. I don't, I, that's before I even heard your, your love broke through. Way before I heard your love broke through. I had no idea who it was. I kind of thought I was an older guy, but because of how his voice sounds, Keith, you know, he kind of sounds like he's a, he sounds like he's, he's older to me. I, 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 didn't, I, I didn't know who he even was, but I really like liked that melodic line there, chorus or whatever, so. I wasn't was looking for the song you Create Me a Clean Heart. I was looking for the song you like both through when I first heard it. It was so amazing and it touched my, my soul so easily. It just spirit had to have that. I mean, but I wish I wish Thor or whoever you guys like whoever whoever directs the sound, the, the music during intermission, play older stuff. Play Stephen Curtis Chapman, Brown Bannister, Keith Green, Amy Grant, I would love you Easy talk to Mac. Too much, too much newer now. I mean, these talks a little older, but him. Yeah. Play the old stuff. That, that's the best stuff. Unless you, you just don't care about that kind of stuff or whatever. It doesn't get you to as well or whatever. Or maybe you don't, you don't know about it, but that's my kind of thing. Just tell y'all. If you want to do that, then please do it. Because that's what I like to hear. That's the kind of stuff. But let's get started right here. This song is called, well, it's by, this is by Brown Bannister. It came out, it came out in 1981 by Reunion Records. Um, Amy Grant's actually using a harmony with him in this song. This is Brown Bester's version of Create in Me a Clean Heart. I think, I think it's originally by Keith Green. It could be by someone else. I guess someone like, whoever could wrote this, but at the point, but let's get to it, okay? Here we go. <laughs> Creating me a clean heart 
pain heart. Although we still live in a simple earth, and if we had a clean heart, we would, we would be our own God, per se. And that's blasphemy. Uh, God is king. Whether we, whether, whether, we, whether we want him to be that or not, it's not up to us. He created us, and therefore he needs to create in us a clean heart. I guess that means the, the want to do what is actually holy and righteous. But we're never going to want to do that in our own life. Our flesh wants it's about me, me, me. Not, not about you, you, you. It's about me, me, me all the time. That's about what it's about. The Holy Spirit says otherwise. Once he gives you the Holy Spirit of salvation, because you could not the Constitution to save you from your sin and your own self from going to hell and our Lord's punishments, okay, from, from, from rejecting his existence, he's going to punish you if you don't. Accept him, basically. Well, no, if you keep on hating him and keep on rejecting him, oh, I know he exists, but I don't care about him. I hate him. Uh, I don't, I, I don't believe in him. I, I like he believes in me. I, oh, he, I, don't, I, I don't think he loves me at all, or whatever. That's basically saying you don't, you, you don't believe in God, or you don't have any faith in him. But that's beside the point. That, that's people who don't already know, the, you know the, the strangers who, 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 who in my neighborhood here probably don't even know who the Lord is. Personally, they probably have to have to start their faith journey or their walk yet. But I'm praying, hoping that they will. I hope that you guys, you guys do as well, because they need, they need, they need, they need even more than we do. We 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 already have them, but they don't have them yet. So they have got to have them. I know that the world will get will get to them someday. If that's what the world wants with their life, basically saying the Lord basically decides who gets to go to heaven or not. I don't know if I'm even going to heaven, but I probably am. Because I already believe in God, so I'm going to heaven. But I don't need to start preaching here, guys. I'm just trying to speak my mind. If that's all right, y'all. But that's all the video. I'm actually going to do another cover in a minute called uh, Talk, to one, Talk to One Another. This is actually Brown's first song. In that, in his, his only album is called Talk to One Another. So this is actually the last song I just played on an album. So, hope you guys liked it. Hope, hope it touched your spirit and your heart. It always has, it always does for me. So, God bless y'all today. God bless y'all today. I might see you guys soon. Today or tomorrow, I'll be playing bass. Probably doing it outside, whatever. I'll do my thing. But hope to see all of you, all of you guys, brothers, brothers, sisters, and, and hopefully strangers too. I'll be seeing you guys. But hope you guys find God too. I'm sure you will, so see you guys later. Peace out.